So when you are sealing the filament itself, you have to make sure you use these parts here to match into the diameter of the, the film itself. So you make sure you have to put it in, should lock into place, kind of cuff it down, and then you kind of spin it over and do the other side. Sorry, just for a moment here. And then you, you put this side here, just kind of push it in there, kind of just locks into place. It should stay there. So for the left component of the cup sealing machine, you'll probably have something like this or even one with a styrofoam roll where you just kind of cuff it into it. But make sure you are, you know, sealing this part right here together with this part. Uh, you're going to have to kind of just kind of place it inside that piece here. That's a little hard for you to see right now, but just give me a second to kind of steady this. So it kind of looks like this. There should be a ring right there connecting to that piece and you kind of just push it in together as so make sure you push the metal piece down see and it locks into place should be steady it's with the gears there other models they will have just like a regular piece of you know cardboard foam and then that would just be the same thing as this piece here where you just kind of just push it in to the cardboard so we're on to the component where you're going to put the gear on the left side into the machine. Make sure you match the hole here. Should uh, be able to enter right in without you know any issues. It kind of has to go out this other way. Yeah. And then you'll start to see that the gears would begin to match. It'll definitely match. You can tell it's in there. It's not going to move anywhere. The machine is left off right now. But uh, that would be the same part for the film itself as well. While locking in the film, you have to make sure according to the image it shows on the machine itself, it will show you how to rotate this film. So you have this one going here at a counterclockwise you know, direction. So the, the end of the film has to be pointing from the left side of the roll. So you just have to place it in there with it pointing down this way. See how it looks like that? It matches the image that's on the machine itself. So it has to come out this way. Make sure once you have this on there, you, you also put your uh, little washers over it, but also this little clamp so you can hold this into, into place. Just give me one second here. So you wanna squeeze that in, hold it in so this is not gonna jumble around. Same thing on this side as well. You always want to kind of have them lock into place. Kind of squeeze this clamp here, push it in, bang. So it's not gonna move anywhere. It's gonna be still locked into place. Okay, so now that you have everything routed, it should look like the one in this photo here, that sticker. So the, the roll has to go counterclockwise, going this way, and it has to go through this part right here. And make sure it is touching the black part of the film into that sensor. See how it's turning red? See, it has to turn red once it matches this little black piece in the sensor. So you would go over here, and make sure you go under here, and over this part. I can't stress that enough. You have to make sure it goes around this part and over this. If you put this under, if you route this beneath that metal bar here, it's not gonna be right. So you have to keep going and, and once again, over, not under. And then now you would kind of loop it around here and you know, attach it right here and, and you have to kind of rotate it counterclockwise back into the roll. So I'm gonna go ahead and test the cup. And that was gonna be it, man. Ta-da! And it seals. And it cuts.